Hello, my name is Dr. Roger Duber. I am a cardiologist that has been practicing in the Alpen, California area for approximately 38 years. During this period of time, I've had the, the opportunity to be practicing at San Antonio Regional Hospital and recently have been appointed the Director of Cardiac Service Lines, which is a very exciting time as I'll explain to you all the different new features we'll be having available at our institution. First of all, I'd like to invite you for our series of community lectures that I believe that you will find both entertaining and educational, and all the new features we'll be providing here at our institution. One of our main features is our STEMI program, which uh, is the treatment for heart attacks due to clogged arteries. We are responsible to responding to three counties in this area where we are able to open up arteries within 90 minutes of onset of symptoms that has been shown to significantly reduce the chances of severe illness, damage to the heart muscle, and death. And our times have been continually improving due to participation by various departments of our hospital, all working to provide the optimal care for our heart attack patients. Also during this period of time, we've had new staff that have come along bringing new features, new ways to open up arteries, including drills called atherectomy or rotablator, as well as laser and new devices that are on the horizon. Another feature that we are now have available at San Antonio Regional Hospital is we're partnering with Cedars-Sinai Medical Center with an advanced heart failure program for those patients who have a severely weakened heart muscle that require optimal therapy and may require more advanced treatment, including possible transplantation. Another new feature that we are going to be presenting this year is our electrophysiological program. And this is a program that will be able to take care of patients who have difficult and complex heart irregularities requiring advanced procedures to hopefully cure them of their problem. Another new feature in the past few years has been our structural program. And this is uh, a program that is intent on repairing or resolving severe structural problems, including advanced valvular uh, disease of the heart, such as severe narrowing of the aortic valve, severe leakage of the mitral valve, and holes in the heart that we can close with various catheters going through the groin area and avoiding open heart surgery. Another feature is that we have been advancing is our transesophageal echocardiogram program where we can look at the heart from the esophagus in a three-dimensional manner and basically be able to almost reproduce what the heart would look like live from the inside. Another feature that we are now have available is our shock team. Through our coronary care unit, including our physicians and nurses, we are able to promptly take care of patients who suddenly have a cardiovascular event where their blood pressure is severely depressed and require emergency therapy. Um, our cardiac rehabilitation program has been a mainstay at San Antonio Regional Hospital for many years and we are very fortunate to have the best nurses give the best care to patients who are, who are recovering from an acute cardiovascular illness. We are lucky to have the best nursing who are very compassionate and want to see our patients return to a full and active lifestyle. And of course, we cannot do this without the administration supporting all of our different programs and advancing us in every direction possible. Finally, I would like to emphasize that San Antonio Regional Hospital has been named a top 50 cardiovascular hospital in the nation by IBM Watson. This is a result of all the hard work by the physicians, nursing, ancillary staff, and administration. This award that was presented to us in 2020 was the result of significantly higher inpatient survival rates, fewer patient complications, higher 30-day survivals after having a heart attack, fewer readmissions, lower length of stay, and total cost per patient care. 
this is a result of everybody working as a team. And that's what San Antonio Regional Hospital is, teamwork. Once again, I'd like to invite you to participate in our series of community lectures here at San Antonio Regional Hospital that, again, I believe you will find very educational and entertaining, covering a lot of subjects for 2022. Thank you.